Welcome to the six week reading boost program. Let's look at some of the exercises in the reading one and two programs, the skills these programs improve and how they align with Australian curriculum standards for language and literacy. There are six programs in this series. The Sonic Learning Team will talk with you and decide which program you should start on. This video will look at some of the games in the reading one and reading two programs. The Reading 1 program is suitable for students in Year 1 and above who are beginning readers and supports the early reader to begin to read independently. The Reading 2 program is suitable for students in Year 2 and above who are emerging readers. This program builds on the early reading and spelling skills addressed in Reading 1 and supports students to begin to understand reading comprehension rules. These programs are designed to improve the core reading skills of phonemic awareness, phonics and decoding, spelling, comprehension of sentences and passages, vocabulary and fluency. At the same time, it trains the cognitive skills of memory, attention, processing of images and sounds and sequencing. By training these skills together, students develop skills that will actually help them to examine, analyze and remember information. Instead of just teaching students how to read and spell words, these programs go much further by teaching students how to use what they read. In addition, these programs can help students reach these curriculum goals in the areas of language and literacy. Our first game is Bear Bags from the Reading 1 program and its follow-on game, Bear Bags More Lunch from the Reading 2 program. These games focus on phonemic awareness, phonics and decoding, vocabulary and fluency for letter recognition. Begins with the same sound as dog. Begins with the same sound as cup. Begins with the same sound as as ram begins with the same sound as five. Students sort words into appropriate sound based categories. Fig <coughs> ends with the same sound as cup, ends with the same sound as bed, ends with the same sound as hat ends with the same sound as tub red pup bib has the same beginning as cloud and clear has the same beginning as sweater and swallow has the same beginning as princess and prove has the same beginning as scoop and sculptor scare score scatter Swish. Our next game is a spelling game, Magic Rabbit, from the Reading 1 program, and its follow-on game, Magic Bird, from the Reading 2 program. These games focus on phonemic awareness, phonics and decoding, spelling and fluency for letter and word recognition. Cup. Pup. Rope, hope, fin, win, cash, smash, Smash, broke, smoke, smoke, speak. These games are all about phonics and quickly recognizing letters and sounds. We're going to look at Flying Fish from the Reading 1 program and its follow-on game, Fish Frenzy, from the Reading 2 program. Look at the word the pelican says and then find the fish that says the same word. B. 
from had from but this by had these games use the top 600 high frequency words and all of the prep through three year level dolch sight words Let's look at some reading comprehension exercises, Buzzfly from the Reading 1 program and Dogbone from the Reading 2 program. These games focus on building early reading comprehension skills while increasing oral vocabulary and also reading fluency by providing the student with modelled fluent reading and repeated reading opportunities. Gordon is a bear who lives in the woods. He wants to be pals with a bird. Where does Gordon live? In the woods. As the student's reading comprehension improves, the passages become longer and more difficult. Where do city people live? In apartments. Students also practice interpreting charts and tables. These games also focus on building reading comprehension strategies while exposing students to new vocabulary and reading fluency building techniques. Let's look at Bedtime Beasties from the Reading 1 program and Leaping Lizards from the Reading 2 program. For an airplane trip, I take a large suitcase. I bring a clean shirt and a pair of Pants. Students also practice using capitals and punctuation. Sugar is used to make things sweet. And they also practice age-appropriate rules of English grammar. So, are you ready to get started? We're looking forward to working with you. To enrol, either call or email us or click the enrol button below.